Hello everybody, welcome back to another unique rare weapon location guide here on Fallout 4. Today we're back in the Far Harbor DLC and I'm going to be showing you guys how to get the Skipper's Last Stand which is a unique rare harpoon gun. Uh, so to do this I'm not going to spoil too much but you're going to need to pick up a mission called Shipbreaker um, and basically you've got to tune into the Shipbreaker's frequency somewhere in this area I find him down here. Uh, it's just one of these where you randomly walk around and then suddenly a uh, like a miscellaneous mission pops up. Uh, so tune into the si ship breaker's signal and uh, that will give you one of those uh, little radar things where you've got to uh, find the signal strength closer and closer. When you get to 100% you will see the big um, badass creature called the ship breaker. You've, all you've got to do is kill him and then uh, once you, he's died it tells you to come to old Longfellow's cabin and uh, go and talk to old Longfellow. So I'm right here, that is uh, north of Far Harbour, right on the other side of the island where I found Shipbreaker. And uh, yeah, you basically just go up to him and then just uh, ask him about Fogcrawler. And uh, you're going to basically just tell him that uh, you know, you've been trying to find this thing for ages. Um, and he's called uh, Shipbreaker and uh, that he's dead now and uh, the guy will be like well I want to kill him myself kind of thing but thank you anyway and as a reward you can see here is the skipper's last stand so this does 150 damage resistance while reloading it has a damage of 345 mind us yours will probably be different um, it uses harpoons slow fire rate it has a fire rate of 2 a range of 143 Accuracy of 63, weight of 16.3, and mine is valued at 1,005 caps. So let's go ahead and equip this, and uh, yeah, let's see how uh, what we think about this gun. So uh, I've come to uh, this place right here, the hotel, um, and yeah, basically uh, there is a very special way to use this weapon. Um, I'm probably not against the greatest enemies up uh, to use this weapon with. They are the uh, the rock hard charred um, ghouls. Uh, very tough. But as you can see, if you can land a shot quite well, um, it will pretty much insta kill them. Um, a headshot really is better than anything else. Uh, but if you know, it's so slow and so hard to aim. I mean, if you do aim down the sight, your crosshairs totally disappear. Uh, but yeah, basically, you've just got to take your time with this thing. Try and hip fire it, get your crosshairs somewhere near the head, uh, or use a critical shot in Vaz. Uh, that will help a lot more. But it's very easy to miss, you know, uh, very easy to miss indeed. But there you go, you saw a, a full on headshot right there, close range, and uh, that charred gruel went down like a sack of spuds. But uh, yeah, definitely a specialist kind of weapon to use. Uh, uh, don't use it in large mobs and things like that, because you only get one shot every good couple of seconds. Uh, and if you do miss a shot and a ghoul comes running towards you, uh, he's going to get you, basically. But if you can land them headshots, if you're accurate enough, then you are, you're going to be flying really. These harpoon guns are very powerful, very, very powerful indeed. Uh, so yeah, it's just a case of knowing how to use it really. Anyway, there you go guys. That is another unique rare weapon location guide here on the Far Harbor DLC. And that is how to get the Skipper's Last Stand. Go out, find Shipbreaker, uh, the ancient fog crawler, and uh, kill him. And you'll get this gun. Anyway, thank you. Uh, check the link in the description if you want to find out more Far Harbor DLC videos. There's absolutely loads now in the, the playlist. F link in the description, like I said. Anyway, thank you, and I'll see you in the next one.